I'm Neil. And I'm Debbie McGowan. We farm at Inchich here, just on the perth Serangus border. There's about 1,200 acres. It's an upland livestock farm with a couple of hundred cows and about a thousand ewes. So the preparing for sustainable farming, um, the claim side for the soil analysis was a really easy process. You just needed a copy of your um, soil analysis and a copy of your statement, bank statement for actually paying for that um, soil sampling and, um, and then the money came back through from the Scottish Government. We do regular soil samples. Anyway, so um, this scheme has allowed us to, to just uh, uh, do a little bit extra and, uh, and, and gain more insight into the farm. For the preparing for sustainable farming soil sampling section, they ask you in addition to do the organic matter and the carbon storage in your soils. So that was something we hadn't done much of before and that was really interesting because the field that we're in now came back as 7.7% um, when the average thinking was 3%. So we're standing on 775 tonnes of stored carbon here, um, whereas um, we kind of thought we had about 300. So it gives you an actual figure of actually what is here rather than a presumed um, amount. And the other side of it was the nutrient side that helped you. Yeah, the regular uh, the regular soil analysis information that comes back um, uh, has has allowed us to build up a profile of of the uh, particularly the, the phosphate and potash levels on the farm and when fertilizer prices were particularly high last year um, it allowed us to um, target some fields where we we could uh, we could uh, hold back on fertilizer. The options that we're considering to claim this year will be soil sampling again along with um, bull fertility and um, probably the feck efficiency in the sheep. Yeah, the faecal egg reduction test, um, is, we've not done one for a year or two and we're, we're due to do one anyway. And I think um, uh, we fairly regularly put a few uh, old ewes away just for analysis for um, iceberg diseases and there's a box on that, um, um, which is it's, uh, uh, something we should be doing again this year. For any farmers that are thinking about doing the PSF um, and haven't already done so, um, I'd certainly recommend that you go ahead and, and do it. It is a very simple um, form, probably the easiest one I've ever filled in. Um, and it's, it's giving you money for something that you're probably already doing um, on your farm already.